Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're solving a really cool exponential equation, and it's all about smart substitution and applying exponential laws. The question is, if 4 raised to the power 1 minus x plus 4 raised to the power 1 plus x equals 10, what is the value of x? Sounds tricky? Don't worry, let's break it down step by step. Step 1. Recall the laws of exponents. Before jumping in, let's quickly recall two important rules we'll be using. First, a to the power m minus n equals a to the power m divided by a to the power n. Second, a to the power m plus n equals a to the power m times a to the power n. We'll use these to simplify and transform the equation. Step two, start solving. Now the given equation is, 4 to the power 1 minus x plus 4 to the power 1 plus x equals 10. Let's apply the exponent rules we just discussed. The first term becomes 4 divided by 4 to the power x, and the second term becomes 4 times 4 to the power x. So the equation becomes 4 over 4 to the power x plus 4 times 4 to the power x equals 10. Now let's make it easier by substituting. Let's say 4 to the power x equals y. Then the equation becomes 4 over y plus 4y equals 10. Step 3. Eliminate the denominator. To get rid of the fraction, multiply the whole equation by y. You'll get 4 plus 4y squared equals 10y. Now bring all terms to one side to form a quadratic. 4y squared minus 10y plus 4 equals 0. Let's simplify by dividing the whole equation by 2. 2y squared minus 5y plus 2 equals 0. Step 4. Solve the quadratic. Time to factor. We split the middle term. 2y squared minus 4y minus y plus 2 equals 0. Now group the terms. 2y times y minus 2 minus 1 times y minus 2. And that gives us y minus 2 times 2y minus 1 equals 0. Solving this, we get two values for y. y equals 2, or y equals 1 half. Step 5. Back substitute and solve for x. Remember, we assumed 4 to the power x equals y. So now we solve each case one by one. Case 1. y equals 2. So 4 to the power x equals 2. Write 4 as 2 squared. So we get 2 to the power 2x equals 2. Now, equate the exponents. 2x equals 1, which gives us x equals 1 half. Case 2, y equals 1 half. So, 4 to the power x equals 1 half. Again, write 4 as 2 squared. 2 to the power 2x equals 2 to the power negative 1. Now, equating powers, 2x equals negative 1, which gives x equals negative 1 half. Final answer? So the two possible values of x are x equals 